<laughs> We're having a good time here on Go. Good morning, everyone. Time is now 924, and it is time for our Pet of the Week segment. Our buddy Rudd, he is so excited. That's what you hear us laughing because he was trying to greet our friend Kaitor here today. But today, Jim Sebastian from the Humane Society of Summit County is here. Mm -hmm. Talk to us a little <laughs> bit about our energetic and mm -hmm. friendly guy, Rudd. Yeah, this big, fluffy, friendly guy's name is Rudd. He's a three to four year old husky, Siberian husky, which means he's basically an outdoor, very cold weather dog living mm -hmm. here in Northeast Ohio. Um, got a lot of energy, super friendly, great with kids. He's one of our ambassador dogs at the shelter. We actually take him out in the community quite a bit because he's just so relaxed, loves attention. Um, so he's and he's all ready to go. He's ready for adoption. Yeah, ready for his home. Rudd has beautiful fur. Mm -hmm. He reminds me of a. Uh, do you remember the dog yeah. Balto in yes. the animated yeah. show movie? Yeah. So and that's like I said. Um, like you mentioned, he's. Um, you know, they they are bred for the outdoors. If you actually go up into the Alaska area, um, they're sled dogs. So which means they've got a lot of energy. They pull the sleds. You know. Mm. Yeah. So that's what originally what they were they were kind of made for, and that's that's kind of their. Um, so <laughs> if you if you take him home, just keep, keep in mind, you know, he's got a he's got a winter coat that is going to come off. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> so he's going to shed a lot of fur. Um, and he's also going to be very energetic. So, um, you know, you need to make sure that they're able to keep up with that, you know, take him outside for long walks and, and whatnot. But other than that, I mean, he's just the friendliest dog. He, he just is. loves attention. Hi yeah. there. Hi yeah. there, Rudd. And yeah. he has the most beautiful blue grayish eyes. I wish we can get a very close, wow. good close up of him because he is gorgeous. So now you say, he basically needs an active family. He does. He doesn't, like you said, first of all, those eyes, we say they, they just pierce into your soul. He just looks right at you. They're really, really bright blue, which is typical of the breed. Huskies have that. Um, and just like you said, he does need a house or a home where he can have a little bit of a, uh, of stimulation energy he's got a lot of it um, we actually found him our humane officers did he was kept in a crate outside and that's just not conducive oh, so no. we, yeah and when you know once we got him in the shelter he's really thrived um, he thinks that he has gone to heaven being in the shelter little does he know once he finds a home it only gets better wow yeah. yes you are so correct there now how much will Rudd uh, run so, so yeah so you know once you come into the humane society um, before you take him home just keep in mind that he is um, he's neutered up to date on his shots um, and he's been given a clean bill of health and you get all that for about $200. Mm. Yeah, and I give him a first bag of dog food too. So he's really, he really is, all our animals at the shelter are like that. Um, he's also microchipped. So really you can just come in the shelter, adopt him, take him home. You don't need to immediately get him into a vet. He's all set, all ready to go. What right. about any other dogs? Oh, great with other dogs. Okay. He loves other dogs. Actually, in a home with another resident dog, I think would be ideal for him because if you have to go to work and he's got another dog to interact with, that would help him stimulate him mentally and physically. He loves other dogs. That's why we have, we have him out in the community so much. So if somebody approaches us with their dog, he's very, very calm. So this is, this is him. <laughs> Love it. Well, thank you, Jim, so thank much you for, for being here, yes. Rudd. Thank you. And if you want to adopt Rudd, we will have all of the information on WKYC.com.